Hey, do you ever want to talk about your favorite video game franchises? Well, we sure do. I get what you're thinking. That's a lot of expression for an intro. Wait around until the end when you see how many takes it actually took to get it. But without further ado, I'm Scott. I'm Jen. We're Retro Rivals, and we're going to talk about some of our favorite video game franchises. Yes. Calm down. This is part one of probably two, maybe or three. three. Maybe Who knows? Four. Who knows? Criteria for this was we needed to play a good majority of the games in the franchise, or we couldn't add it. So yeah. there's not going to be, for example, I haven't been able to add Metroid to this because I've only played Super Metroid. Do we have more Metroid games? Yes, but I haven't played them yet. I endeavor to want to play them, but I haven't played them yet. All right, so let's start talking about some games. Games! I know. So on the PS2, <laughs> Silent Hill number three. Yes. So Silent Hill the franchise, but we picked Jen's favorite so far yes. of the Silent Hill franchise. Yes. That may shock some people because. Do you play Silent Hill games? No. He hasn't played a one. Don't so really this care is all to. mine. Don't care. <laughs> uh, well, I've played one, two, three, and Chattered Memories. I hear the room is really good. Two tends to be most people's favorite. Yeah. I liked three better. I don't know what it was about it. I liked the whole setup of it. I liked where you're kind of in this like amusement park at first. You go back there, you're in the apartment. Like there's so many different areas where I felt so Silent Hill 2, you spend your bulk majority of the time in one specific area. It is better than the first one in that regard. I don't know, I just liked 3. I liked the bosses in 3. I liked you were in the mall. I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm a girl. girl in the mall. It was just a girl in the mall. You're playing a girl. You're in the mall. This it's girl's creepy. talking too much. You're yeah, done. but I really like that. And I know. It's, it's a great franchise. I uh, would love to see more Silent Hill games. We haven't had a new one. We're getting one. remakes now. We're getting remakes. So, but I'd like to see new ones. Kind of like they're doing with Resident Evil. So, this franchise is the Streets of Rage. Yes. One, two, three, four. But yep. my favorite still is Streets of Rage number two. Yes. The Sega Genesis. Loved it. Have we ever played through this together and beat the game? I beat this game more times. I know. I'm just wondering if we I need hand lotion at this time. <laughs> this mess I've beaten so many times. <laughs> yeah. Streets of Rage number two, as you have, well, there was how many characters? Four or five? Something like that. I always pick the girl. So. Yeah, and I always took Axel for the most part, but I know I've gone through it with every character. Yeah. Yeah. And um, I really enjoy number one. I love number two. Uh, I'm not crazy about number three. Yeah. It's number probably four a little too was difficult. Fun. And I love number four. Yeah. Number four was really good. We did. You did play through number four. With I me. did play through yeah. number four with you. Now, have we ever played Streets of Rage four with Dennis? Is it no. not? Dennis more has never touched it. I do believe it is. Up to four players, yeah, possibly. Yeah, that's what right? I'm saying. Maybe we need to play that. Yeah, I'd play that again. I would. Yeah. yeah. Let's do a co-op one here, Jenny. Co-op. So, on the Xbox 360, we have Guitar Hero, and we kind of couldn't decide yeah. on what was our favorite. We have Guitar uh, Hero Metallica and Guitar Hero Warriors of Rock. If yeah. I go to grab a single game off the shelf, it's... Probably Metallica, but I really I remember really loving Warriors yes. of Rock. Well, we tend to grab Metallica, I think, when we play Guitar Hero because you Metallica. can't get you also can't get it on Rock Band. You can't play, yeah. It's it's not available, which is weird to me because on the Warriors of Rock collection, there's Megadeth songs. Yeah, I know that's. Cool. And I'm like, why? Because you that's get probably Megadeth why I songs enjoyed it so much on Rock Band, but you can't yeah. get them on you can't get Metallica on Rock Band, so it's it's a bit weird. Mm. I don't know how we're going to show gameplay footage of this. I guess you're going to put some in. And <laughs> He's just going to show barb. And <laughs> some other different song. Like, you can't really show anything. You I think can't. you're just going to put up the collection that we have. Yeah, I don't understand why. I know it's copywriting, but... You all the music itself, Yeah, right? I think yeah. if you're, if you're why, showcasing it, why can't you? That's why I'm trying to put the games away and talk less. Okay. Okay. I didn't know. I'm a girl. Okay. This one here... Definitely my franchise. Yes. It's the SmackDown franchise on the PS2. I could not pick one that was my favorite because there's three of them that I love. It's yeah. SmackDown, Here Comes the Pain. Just 
bring it. Smackdown, just bring it. And Smackdown, shut your mouth. These three, I loved all three yeah. of them. And then I think it started into the Smackdown versus Raw. I don't know if I consider that a different franchise. I don't. I kind of, it's all the same franchise in yeah. my opinion. So you don't have a favorite amongst those because I feel like you do. I tend to lean towards this, but I know I love this one. And then it's like, if you get tired of this one, you put that one in. They, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. They're all great. They all basically have well, the same mechanics. I think mechanics. this was in the era where wrestling was considered at its peak. Still the attitude era. era. Yeah. So yeah, I, I get that. I even played them a little bit. Yes. Here and there. I tried. Oh, I tried. Basically gave you a good old spanking. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> all right, I'm going to do this one here because it's yours. Uh, okay. Yeah. So... This is one of Jenny's favorites. Yeah. Super Nintendo. Yes. Franchises. Donkey Kong Country 2 is the favorite it of is. the three, but you've also played uh, Tropical Freeze. Tropical Freeze, and obviously I've, I've mentioned this before too. I've played the one on the Atari and uh, Donkey Kong Jr. So just Donkey Kong just in Donkey general. Just Donkey Kong in general. Um, I tend to love, but this one... This Donkey Kong and then Donkey Kong Country is kind of different franchise, well, it's, but it's I think you're kind of going mascot at that point. Yeah, kind of mascot yeah. at that point. Um, but this one is a standout favorite of mine. I I think the music's better in two. You're going, some of you are going to disagree and some of you are going to pat me on the back. And I just thought this one did so much more than the original and was the just the pillar of greatness of the Donkey Kong Country fran franchise. That's my opinion. Three is good, two. Pillar of two greatness. is the best. Two is the best. The I have... Pillar of greatness. Of the Donkey Kong Country series. They're like... It was so great. There was nothing I didn't love about it, even when I was hating my life trying to get through a roller coaster stage. So. <laughs> All right. This would be an Xbox franchise. Yes. It's adorned in our room. <laughs> the Gears of War franchise, and there are six of them because of Judgment. Yeah. So one, two, three, Judgment, four, five. Yeah. Um, and there's also tactics that I did not play. I know when you ask Alex what his favorite is of the older ones on the 360, he keeps saying Judgment. Yeah. And it's odd because a lot of people don't like Don't that like one. Judgment. But when I'm talking about the franchise overall, like, uh, I really liked Five. Five was fantastic, yeah. and we can't wait for the next one to come out, whether it's called Six or whatever yeah. they call it. We started gardening this year, and you're going to have to beat me out, but every time we go to check on the tomatoes outside, we can't just say, let's go check on the tomatoes. We go, let's go check on the tomatoes. <laughs> and anytime we mention tomatoes, in general, I'm like, those are Dom's tomatoes. I can't help it. I, I watched them play it. I saw that scene so I many times. I wonder how many people actually get that reference. Yeah. Yeah. All right. On to the next one. I'm going to do this one. Yeah. So, another popular franchise. I have not played every single one of them, but I played most of them. And I think this is going to surprise people. I think I'm only people. missing three of them in total, but it is God of War. Three is yeah. my favorite of the God of War series Which so is going to kill people because of 2018 yeah. and Ragnarok. Yeah, I have not played Ragnarok. Um, Ragnarok. I have not played Ascension, and I have not played two. Yeah. But I've played the rest of them. There, that means there's two of them on the PSP. I played number one. I played the 2018 version. Yes. I, yeah, so I've played a lot of God and I've played the first three. So I felt like it was a good oh, one. Oh, you have played all three. Yeah, the first I three. All three. Okay. Yeah. Super fun. I loved all of them. Number three was fantastic. The, the, the third one is the best out of the first, first three, three, for and sure. And you don't you don't know because you haven't played the the newest. That's right. I haven't played any of the new ones on the PS4, or PS5. I haven't played any of the PSP games. I want to, but there's so many games and so little time. Right? Yeah. All right. So I have a nice switch. I don't know if it's a Switch franchise because you can get we have yeah. four on PS4. Anyway, yeah. Trine. We picked Trine Five as yes. our favorites. Um, 
Only because I think it's slightly better than four. Yes. We played four first, and then we got the collection, and then we played one, two, three. Yeah. And then five. It's a puzzle game, up to four players. We uh, have were... more fun pissing each other yeah, off. Yeah, we laughed so much yeah. playing that fourth one. We had to play through the rest of them, even though some of them weren't as good. Three is hot trash terrible yes but we still had a lot of fun we did it. and yep. you switch between three different characters you're like a, you're like a hero the there's knight, a knight yeah there's an archer there's and there's a, a magician wizard, yeah. yeah wizard yeah. and they all have different attributes and different skills and you build your skill tree too a little bit like it's basically to figure out how to get through those puzzles. You're gonna exactly. Use each one skill. You do you do fight big bosses. Yep. But a lot of what you're doing is puzzles Puzzling. to get to the next area. Yep. It's really fun. All right, let's do this one. Yes. On the PlayStation. Surprising no one who watches this channel. Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Uh, of the Castlevania franchise was this one was picked as our favorite. Yes. I cannot really talk as much about the Castlevania franchise as you because I, this is the only Castlevania that I've ever finished. Yes. You have actually played through all the ones on the, the DS, DS and 3DS. 3DS. I and played a little bit on the Genesis. But Castlevania, the ones that I have played, the 3DS one maybe is the one that I'd be like, ah, play that one last. Or play it first to kind of get it out of the way. It's still good. Just, I remember playing it and did not enjoy it. I, so. I really enjoyed it, but it is different than yeah. the other ones. But um, Symphony of the Night, while it is my favorite, Portrait of Ruin, Dawn of Sorrel, and Order of Ecclesia are right there. They're amazing. I think I like Order of Ecclesia the best. You, you can ask me on any given day. still haven't played the Game Boy Advance ones, have you? I know! I got all those ones to play. Mario I got Soro, all the Nintendo ones to play. Circle of the Moon, and yeah. I think there's another one there. I think we got that collection on the PS5, did we not? Or yes, we did. So, yes, yeah. we did. Yes, we did. There's no excuse you should There's no there. excuse for me not to be playing them, <laughs> and that's where I found my love for Metroidvania. And when I was playing the ones on the DS, I know I put like 20, 30 hours into each game. If not more. And I was like, Didn't want to put it down. Oh, I yeah. couldn't put it down. Yeah. I want to play it every day. So, last one. Yep. Is a franchise that goes over generations. Yes. We love the River City franchise, but this is River City Girls. I don't know if you guys will argue of that fact. River City Girls number two is our favorite. Uh, yes. We played one and two. We played quite a bit of the. Uh, River City Ransom. Yes. Never finished it though. We should just play just through jump it. Jump in, go all the way. Yeah. Just grind. And There's fight. one River City Girls we haven't played yet. Zero, I think. At it is. Zero, yep. and it's just we two have player it in the game. collection. We have it in the collection, yeah. Yeah. But we played this three player. Number two, we played three player. Oh my we god. We loved it. All three of us loved it. So good. Yep. So good. Can't wait for another and one. And we made Dennis pick either one of the guys because we're like we play. <laughs> we have our girls there. We, we played from girls. the first one, yeah. We I had got to... the redhead. Yeah, I got the one. <laughs> and uh, she was. Yours was more bubbly, and I got the one that's more grizzled. I was like, we're playing. Just like us. We're playing. You're playing the character that you had the same hair color with, but not the same personality. What's that supposed to mean? I love you. It's what it means. All right. It's what it means. So, so this is ten of our favorite fan franchises. And we had a lot more. We have enough for at least one more video. Yeah. And if we thought hard enough, there could be another. There time. definitely could be another. And we invite you in the comments to uh, tell us what some of your favorite franchises yeah. are and if you uh, want to do a video response more oh welcome. my god we're always up for that until next time i think that's all i got to say i i was really quiet this video you should have seen the startup of this video it was horrendous we'll probably put it at the end as an outtake until next time game what's going on there partner where are you going so fast remember we got to watch those outtakes how many times do you think it took to get through it you guess right now and go. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. Hey, do you ever want to talk about your favorite? <laughs> you said, hey, hey. <laughs> Can you do it again? All right, ready? Yeah. Hey, do you ever? Stop that. <laughs> it felt like a, this. Hey, <laughs> let me do my thing. <laughs> you do it. I don't even know what I was saying. Hey. Hey, do you ever want to talk about your favorite video game franchises? I couldn't say it. <laughs> 
Cake okay. four. Cake four. Thanks, Jen. Hey, I, no could have, I could have rolled this out in the first one. <laughs> like, bring the smile down a little. <laughs> a little, just a little less tea. It looked a little less jokery. <laughs> Are you pooping? All right, ready? Yeah. Straight face. Okay. All right? Yeah. Hey, did you ever... Would you <laughs> off with it? <laughs> I'm trying to... I'm trying to add something to it already. <laughs> okay. Go ahead. No, I'll, No, I'll no, just... go ahead. Do no. It. No, this is yours now. I tried six times. <laughs> I'll, I'll be quiet and I'll be good. <laughs> Put your hands on the table. And they're right there. You look bored like you fall asleep. No, I'm not going to fall asleep. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. I'm Scott. I'm... It's gonna take a lot longer. 